Little Sister Don't Ya is such a different episode of Cheers for this point in the series. This is the second episode of the second season of Cheers directed by the brilliant James Burroughs. And for once, Sam and Diane are not fighting. They don't fight at all in this episode. And it's been a while since we've had an episode like that. This episode actually focuses on Carla and Carla's sister and also Cliff. And I think this is the first time where Cliff has had an episode that focuses on him. And this is something that I love because in the first season it wasn't clear that he was actually one of the main characters. He was treated more along the lines of characters like Paul, who features in this. I'll talk about Paul in a moment. Um, but now it's very clear that Cliff is one of the main cast. And that I just love. So in this episode, Carla goes into labour. And her sister is taking over her, her job at Cheers while she's looking after the baby. Her sister is called Annette. And Annette is also played by Rhea Perlman, which I just thought was a wonderful decision to make. And Perlman's performance is just fabulous. And I can only imagine how wonderful it would have been to be on that set, acting with Perlman. It, it just would have been magnificent. And I think she does such a great job with this character. And Carla kind of told the Cheers gang that Annette was innocent, sweet. But it quickly becomes apparent that Annette actually is not not like that at all. There is a wonderful scene. I won't explain it too much. I don't want to spoil it. But there's a wonderful scene between Annette and Sam. It's quite brief. Uh, it's the bit where Coach Coach is there, and um, oh, it's just wonderful. It's just brilliant. Even more brilliant when you remember that it's Rhea Perlman playing this character. But Cliff, Cliff takes a liking to Annette. And I don't want to say too much more about that, but the scene between Norm and Cliff is wonderful. It's unusual for us to have a scene that's that long. I'd say it was maybe five minutes, maybe just a bit shorter than that. It took a good chunk of it where it's just Norm and Cliff. And it's so rare to have just two characters on the screen at any one time. And even when it's Sam and Diane. And just the, the relationship between those two characters and the way they interacted and the stories that they told during those five or so minutes. It was just beautiful. I, I mean, they're my two favourite characters. Norm and Cliff. Absolutely Norm and then Cliff. Um, this is before we get Rebecca, of course. And it was just such a beautiful exchange. And I just think it's one of the greatest Cheers moments of all time. As I said, I was going to come back to Paul. Uh, I was going to mention Paul. Paul actually <laughs> had some pretty brilliant digs at Cliff. I don't necessarily like people making fun of Cliff because I love Cliff. But I have to say it was very well written and very funny. And Norm's line about Cliff not wearing his uniform, I just, it was brilliant. So entertaining. It's so nice to have quite a light episode. Yes, the... The scene between Cliff and Norm was a little heavier, a little more emotional, but generally it's a very funny episode. Nobody's arguing, nobody's fighting, nobody's wondering if Sam and Diane should be together. <laughs> Sam and Diane in this were really annoying, in a really nice, fun way, but their relationship it just, just goes from one extreme to another, but I love it. And this is just a brilliant episode, I absolutely adore it. I feel like the tone of Little Sister Don't You was just perfect. It gave us it gave us a good way for Carla to have her baby without making the focus on her having the baby, which I thought was very, very cleverly done because I don't know about anybody else, but I just always find that when a main character has a baby in any sitcom, it becomes so boring because it always becomes about that baby. But obviously Carla has numerous kids, so it's not exactly new mother territory here. Plus babies and bars tend not to mix that much. But I really enjoyed it. This is a, a fabulous episode. Very funny with some slightly more serious moments now and then. Definitely, as is often the case, another pretty perfect episode. <laughs>